In this video we will tell you about some of the options, which are available to tier 4 students who complete their degrees, and want to remain in the United Kingdom. Many students in the United Kingdom have extreme doubts about, what they will be able to do, after their education ends and, are intensely concerned about the epidemic affecting graduate employment, and hence their own long-term prospects in the United Kingdom. Changing the rules on immigration. A new immigration bill. Points-based immigration system. Brightest and the best. Greatest place to live. Top 6 UK Immigration Options for Graduating Students in 2020 During COVID-19 Pandemic Universities throughout the United Kingdom are choosing numerous methods to how and when final year students will accomplish their degrees, taking COVID-19 limitations into account. Let us talk about the 6 immigration options, which are available to the international students in the United Kingdom. Option number 1. Further study. The amount of time spent in the student visa, and depending on the level of study accomplished, an individual may be able to apply for further studies in the United Kingdom. With the intention of qualifying for a visa extension of a tier 4 student, they would be requiring an offer from an educational institution in the United Kingdom, the finances to pay for the university fees, maintenance costs, and also the student must be able to satisfy the United Kingdom Home Office, that they are a genuine student. Option number 2. Start-up visa. The start-up visa category is for individuals who desire to lead a business in the United Kingdom, even though they will also have the right to work for other businesses as well. To apply in this visa category, an applicant should not have an operating business in the United Kingdom before, and will require to have their business idea recognized, as being groundbreaking, practical and accessible. Many higher education institutions in the United Kingdom, are able to endorse start-up visa applicants, so fresh graduates may aspire to confirm with their universities, if this is something they can present. Option number 3. Innovator Visa Similar to the start-up visa category, an innovator visa applicant will be required to show that, they have a business idea which is groundbreaking, practical and accessible. On the other hand, these are evaluated at a superior level than for those applicants in the start-up visa category. An innovator visa applicant will be required to show that, they have approached to at least £50,000, and if successful, they will only be able to work for their own business, instead of having the suppleness offered to those in the United Kingdom start-up visa category. Option number 4. Global Talent Visa the Global Talent Visa part is for individuals, who are surfacing leaders or already acknowledged as leaders within the field of their work. This could comprise academic work, but also those in the arts, fashion, digital sector, and architecture. Global Talent Visa category, usually obligates some professional work experience, or an advanced degree, so it might not be appropriate for those who are just completing their first degree in the United Kingdom, especially if they have not worked before their studies. Option number 5. Tier 2 Sponsored Work The Tier 2 visa category is for migrants, with a job offer from a company in the United Kingdom. The company will be required to have a sponsor license, to permit it to sponsor migrants in the United Kingdom, but might be able to apply for one if this is not already in place. There are certain obligations, about the skill level for the job and the salary that must be paid, in order for the migrant to be sponsored. Option number 6. Tier 1 Investor Visa To attain a Tier 1 Investor Visa in the United Kingdom, a migrant should have access to £2 million, which is accessible to the migrant to invest into active United Kingdom company. The funds should either have been kept in their name, for a period of two years prior to application otherwise, further proof will be needed to show the source of the funds. The funds must be capitalized in specified ways, designed by the Home Office. Summary Although, obviously there is much vagueness at the moment, there are numerous paths for new graduates to reside in the United Kingdom, once their studies are finished. 
On top of the aforementioned routes, relying on migrants' situations, there may be other options for graduates, for instance, if they have already legally spent a 10-year period in the United Kingdom, it may be possible to apply for long residence, or there are precise routes for individuals in relationships with British, settled or European partners. There are also few temporary worker categories, and certain paths for migrants of certain countries. To establish the most suitable possibility for any migrant, it is always important to go through your full conditions and to take into account all achievable possibilities. To know more, please comment below.